Six, the upcoming rainy season could make an already dangerous situation in San Rafael even worse. The city has yet to repair a landslide that slipped into a family's backyard nearly a year ago. The slide rests behind a home on Glen Eyre Drive in the Bret Hart neighborhood. As KPX 5's John Ramos explains, it might not be repaired until next spring. When a light rain starts to fall on the Bret Hart neighborhood overlooking San Rafael, you can't blame Stacy Clark for getting a bit, well, nervous. Not when her backyard looks like this. They removed 600 cubic yards of debris. From your backyard? From our backyard. On the evening of January 10th, in the middle of a heavy rainstorm, a culvert became blocked, and Irwin Street, just above her house, partially gave way, sending tons of mud and debris down the hill toward her home. It was dark. We couldn't see what was happening. We heard cracking and breaking of trees and uh, retaining walls, I think. Stacy and her family fled their home and were out for three weeks until the city could stabilize the area and add drain pipes. But now, after 10 months, nothing is fixed, and the black plastic is still here. The reason? Because the federal government offered to help. If it was uh, entirely up to us, we would have gotten the road repaired uh, this summer. Uh, but because FEMA is involved, uh, we want to go through the process with them and hopefully get reimbursed for the funding. The city has done all it can, but complying with FEMA's paperwork has been time-consuming, to say the least. Now Public Works has decided Irwin Street is too unstable, and at the next downpour, it will close the street entirely and work on a permanent fix sometime in the spring. But as the rains begin to fall again, it leaves Stacy and her family facing another full winter of worrying at what moment they may have to flee their home again. Is there a lot of rain? Is it an inch? Is it two inches? We don't know at what point it's, you know, we just have to kind of go with what feels right. In San Rafael, John Ramos, KPIX 5.